YouTube, what is going on, guys? And welcome back to another video. Today, we are doing Dragon Ball Super Manga Chapter 81. We moving along, we moving along, but we're going to hop into it right after this. Alright guys, let's hop right into this chapter. So, last chapter, we seen the Ascension of Gas, alright? Now, hop right into the chapter, they don't even go into no talking, no nothing. Gas immediately hits Goku and Vegeta with a, uh, some sort of weight spell, okay? We're gonna call it a weight spell. Goku and Vegeta, their body are super, super heavy. Now, mind you, Goku just got out of battle, got washed. Vegeta, used Ultra Ego to the point where it... Like, <laughs> he's got no energy or little to no energy left. Granola got out for the count last chapter, okay? Now, boy, Gas was about to finish him. Gas was about to finish him, but Granola pops up, okay? Granola pops up behind Elec, hoping to deliver some sort of blow, hoping to get some sort of revenge for what Elec has done to his mother after Granola had found out last chapter that it was not Bardock who killed off the Cerulean's. It was in fact uh, Elec himself, okay? And Elec himself actually was the one to take out Granola's mom single-handedly, okay? So, with that being said, the crazy part, we thought, we thought that Granola was going to get him out of nowhere. Gas teleports Elec out of the way. So, with that being said, Granola tries to use one of his specialty moves and use like, I, we gonna call it a spirit gun because that's pretty much what it is. Spirit gun, all my Yu Yu Hakusho fans, salute. Spirit gun, boy, gas came out of nowhere. I mean, this is the most disrespectful. I've, <laughs> this is the most disrespectful since Vegeta got his arm broke by 18. You feel what I'm saying? This is the most disrespectful. Like, my man's came up and kicked this man Granola's hand so hard, he broke him broke his hands then blinded him with two lasers to the eyes and the sad thing about it is Ela gave granola a taste of the way he actually killed his mom by doing the same exact thing taking the ray gun and blowing his back out balls 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 but blew his whole area out man granola falls in the water like the monito is devastated but Goku is angry not being able to do anything because of the weight of his body Vegeta ends up giving him his energy take care of him Kakarot that's what he says to him as Goku nods turns around to face gas all right Goku is now in Super Saiyan Blue Omen okay and for those of you who do not know what Omen is this is Ultra Instinct okay put over the any transformation so Goku right now is in blue Ultra Instinct okay with that being said, Goku tries to use the talk no jutsu. You feel what I'm saying? Him and Naruto must have been talking. You feel what I'm saying? He tried to use the talk no jutsu on gas. <laughs> yeah, it's like that ain't about to work. Summons spike plates out of nowhere. Summoning spike plates. Doing all of this. My man is magic. All right. Not only summoning spike plates, Goku's dodging. Bing, 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 bing. Then my man summons trains. Full blown trains out of nowhere. How 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 trains? How trains moving at the speed of light in the in the in the air, bro? Like just just out of nowhere. So you pick this up out of out of yeah. Ain't no way, bro. Not only that, my man's put Goku in. Yo, what is going on with the Naruto references here, man? Like talk no jutsu then in the next one my man must have talked to to Kesame or something because this man learned water prison ain't no way this man put Goku in a water prison he was like the ability inability to breathe is something your species is pretty dull for you feel what I'm saying y'all can't breathe underwater that's kind of whack you feel what I'm saying y'all y'all weak as a species Goku tries to actually blast them through the water but to Goku's surprise gas just returned it straight to him blowing the water out of everything okay goku 
in ultra instinct form. Over blue is still no match for gas, period. But here's the thing though, all right? There's one trick that we actually got told two chapters ago. Well, not even two chapters ago, maybe the last chapter that Vegeta was giving us the hint for it. Was the fact of the matter, what was the reason that Granola was over top of gas in the first place? Was because he had some time with his power before gas did. But that wasn't the main thing. That was just a small advantage. The bigger advantage was the fact that Granola understood instant transmission better than gas. You feel what I'm saying? In the last, when Goku was actually going up against gas before the ascension, gas could not keep up with the instant teleportation. It was almost as if he would teleport into the attack itself rather than outside of it, okay? Now, Goku, now using this information to his knowledge, Gas is now understanding why people are able to recover after uh, amount of time goes by, figuring out that the Namekians are healers, okay? So his plan was to drop Monaito first so that nobody could be healed. Goku intercepts gas and teleports them to whose planet none other than my man Jocko Jocko was just trying to go to the mark he was just trying to go to the mark get him one of them nice little space chips you feel what I'm saying next thing you know Goku's bringing gas out onto his planet hey Goku that's you yeah man hey listen uh I'm glad your planet was nearby because you know what I'm saying I don't know where I would have went you feel what I'm saying so Goku proceeds to ask gas you think you can really follow me everywhere I go? Because here's the thing. You you talk about, you know, instant transmission. You can do everything I do. But see, the funny thing about it is I've worked with instant transmission almost all my life for years while you just attained it. So do you really think you can follow me anywhere I go? All right. Now, let's get to the big subject at hand. OK, you've seen it in the title. I'm not I'm not tripping. I'm not taking back what I'm saying, y'all. Here's the reason why, okay? Gas was able to ascend, okay? Get massive amounts of power. Let's talk about his battle IQ. This man's battle IQ is so high, he's able to understand multiple techniques or multiple moves at once. It's almost instantaneously. Granola's out for the count. Vegeta has no energy. And Goku and Mastered Ultra Instinct over Blue is still no match for gas. Let me tell you, you know, you want to know where Goku finally teleported to? And this is my thoughts. I think Goku's trying to set up gas for the fight of his life. All right. You heard me right and you see it in the title correctly. I believe Goku is going to teleport and set gas up. To go to planet Vampa, okay? The only other person who's able to actually understand their battle IQ and be adaptable on the fly is none other than our main man, Broly, okay? Broly has the most potential right now out of all the Saiyans, given the three, the three fighters that we have right now and the two Saiyans part of it, all right? Like I said, Granola can't fight. Vegeta can't fight. Goku can't fight. Yeah, damn sure ain't bringing no Gohan up in here. And you ain't bringing Piccolo or none of them. So who's the only other person besides the higher ups? Cause we can't we can't involve Whis or Beerus. They do not they do not meddle in human affairs, okay? Unless it is a divine level okay if it's human affairs they not doing nothing so who's the strongest person in between there broly broly and this will be a good idea to put broly in this chapter considering the fact that he'll be playing a role in dragon ball super superhero when the movie officially comes out i believe in april okay so make sure you guys are tuned for that guys you did not read that title wrong i said broly versus gas for a reason all right and i hope that you guys see it too guys 
If you enjoyed this video, you already know what to do. Don't be afraid to hover and haunt that like button. Subscribe today to become part of the Soul Gang team. Never let Let's get it. Tap that notification bell to know each and every time that I'm uploading videos. And guys, remember to be good at the game. You gotta kill with skill. And until our next nightmare, guys.